So quite a few of you were asking about the problems I've been having with my PSN account so I thought I'd make a video on it especially now I know that this is a major issue to do with um, the PlayStation Network so yeah so where do we begin um, so yeah a few weeks ago well I say a few weeks ago it's kind of about five weeks now um, I had to okay I went on my PS4 uh, so this was like two weeks after it was released right and um, I went onto my account and it was like signed into PSN. I was like, right, okay, so it hasn't automatically signed me into the online. And I'd recently, like, as in two days before, bought PlayStation Plus. So I thought, all right, well, let's play some online. So I went to go online and it was like, oh, this password is invalid. I was like, right, okay, it hasn't asked me to enter a password. I thought it would just keep on there. So I was like, right, and it's like, oh, um, for security reasons, everyone has been asked to change the password. I was like, okay, right. Or change it. So I put in the date of birth, my email address, and they said, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to email you instructions to make a new password. So this could take up to 24 hours to, to do. Does that send it through to you? So, all right, okay, that's fine. So 24 hours passed, um, and I was like, right, okay, my link hadn't arrived. <laughs> so I was like, right, okay. Um, Maybe, maybe something happened. I'll, I'll do it again. So I enter my details again. Um, and bear in mind, this, this, uh, the, during this time, I, w I couldn't play my PS4 online. I could play it offline, but the problem was all of this, even the campaign stuff, is saved on an online save. So if I wanted to plan the campaign, I'd have to play it all over again. So I was like, right, okay, um, I play FIFA on the Xbox, or whatever, which is, but even though I could play FIFA on the Xbox, it's still annoying, even though I just bought a PS4. And I pre-ordered it to play it, first of all, to record gameplay for you guys, and I couldn't. So that was really annoying. So I did it all again, 24 hours later, still nothing. Okay, repeat the process again, and again, and the fifth time, I was like, no, right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to email them. So after, I think, about 45 minutes of looking, I finally found the email address for you to contact PSN. Because like it's not even on the website, you have to just, I don't know how I found it in the end, but... You have to, there's like a PlayStation one for like, I think it's like systems and stuff, like if you've got problems with your system. And then there's a PSN one, so I emailed them. And they said, uh, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to send you another one. I was like, right, okay, I've heard this before. Um, so a day later, still nothing. So I emailed them again and saying, I've not received this fifth email um, that I was promised. So we'll fix it for me. <laughs> I don't know what oh, I'm supposed to be doing here so they're like okay um, we're having oh that was it they said something like oh, we're very busy at this time um, a reply could take up to 24 hours I was like okay right so at this point it's been about six days since the original issue so I'm still waiting to play on my PS4 online um, and they got back to me and they're like okay right um, for um, your account like for reasons we're gonna have to basically phone you or you forgot to phone us to talk over the phone because we don't want to say your account details by email I was like alright so me and my dad we phoned them we talked about okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna send you an email you an email this could take up to an hour so like, right and five hours later still nothing so okay we'll leave it a few days we left it a few days still nothing so we email them again and again they say okay um, I'm out with it though they said um, we've seen this issue and we've sent it up to head office because it's quite a big issue they're like, okay right they're doing something okay and they're like alright okay this could take up to two days but me and my dad thought right okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave it for like a week we're gonna leave it for a week and let them send it back because it's a big issue it's gone up to head office so they should be back soon a week and a half later today we haven't heard anything, so my dad phoned them, had a massive go at the guy who nearly started crying apparently, and um, basically he said, and was probably the most useful thing any of them have actually told us is, they don't know. They don't know how to fix the problem. It's a massive issue. I was the 10th person tonight to phone them, well my dad was the 10th person to phone tonight, and um, yeah, the PlayStation had just been getting loads of abuse at them by phone, by email, uh, by Twitter or Facebook. And they don't know how to fix it yet. 
but when they do work out to fix it, they're going to email me. So in the meantime, I've had to set up a separate account. And luckily, I can uh, I can like PlayStation accounts are free, and I've got PlayStation Plus, so I can use PlayStation Plus because all my accounts. So I have I have my normal name, and I have Dom temporarily, which is the account I'm using for online stuff only. Because the whole reason that I'm setting up this second account, with people are like, well, why don't you just stick with the second account? The reason I'm sticking with it um, is because, as you guys know. I got the hardened edition of Ghosts, and I get all that stuff, and I put it on my my pro like my my account, and none of that can be accessed on my temporary account, which means that if I was to stick with the second one, I'd have to pay about forty or fifty extra pound, like I'd have to pay fifty quid again when I'd already paid ninety five quid for the hardened edition, which would be a waste of money. So I'm waiting for them to get back to me. So in the meantime, I'm playing online on my second account. Um, but yeah, it's quite annoying, as you can probably tell. So uh, I thought I'd just clear up all the issues in detail. Should be hearing back soon. But yeah, it's a massive issue. Like thousands and thousands of people have been having this problem. But I'm glad that it's like a big issue, not just me. So they're probably more likely to want to hurry and find the issue. But um, yeah. It's pretty annoying, so until then, I'm using my temporary account, and uh, yeah, I think that's about it. So, <laughs> if you guys have been, um, have been getting any issues on any ne like next gen stuff, oh, that's another thing actually. It's not just on PS4, it's on PS3 as well. People have been getting the issues, so I thought maybe it's just a next gen thing, I don't know. But yeah, but let me know in the comments if you've been getting any issues with next gen consoles or any of the online. It's quite quite annoying um, if you've enjoyed this video um, then feel free to like the video and I will see you guys next time